Well, there is a new and open source AI model from Alibaba called One Animate, and this model can be used to replace the character from a video. So for example, there could be a clip from a movie and you can replace the actor or actress with perhaps your own face and honestly, the result is quite convincing. And of course, uh, this model is free, it is open source, which means you can download the way to your computer and run it locally. Although, it is very technical, it is very uh, computationally expensive, and I do not recommend using that method to, to use or play around with this model. Instead, there are two places where you can play around with one animate to replace a character in a video with somebody else's face. So, one way to use this model is via the demo in Hugging Face, and don't worry, I'm going to leave the link in the description down below. But this one is kind of limited and a bit more complicated. In fact, I do recommend to use the second method, which is basically the official website of One.Video. So just navigate to One.Video, and you can create a free account. And by the way, this AI platform will actually give you 10 credits every day for a free, which is enough to generate some images or videos but actually you can use this new feature or model to replace a character in a video without using any credit but there are some caveats anyway let's continue just click generate and then here you want to use the new feature where you can replace the avatar in a video just click video and then click avatar and then click speech to video and then select character swap now you can select a video which in this case is going to be from my computer so let me select the this is part of moment and after that you can select up to 15 seconds of the video clip and click confirm and after that you can upload the character that you want to replace so let me just click this button let's upload this agent 47 picture and after that uh, you can actually select the pro version which doesn't really matter whether you're using the standard or pro because it is not going to be using your credit because apparently this task is very expensive the 10 daily credits that you can uh, use for free is not enough so you have to use the non-credit version so essentially it is free you don't have to pay for anything but one big caveat is it is very, very, very slow. I'm talking about hours of video generation, but if you're totally okay with that, you are just, you know, creating one video a day, I think this is not an issue. So anyway, let's just click this button and just wait uh, for this model to uh, replace the character from the video with the Hitman or Agent 47 character. And I'll be back in a second. Well, finally, I got uh, this video. It took quite some time. Honestly, I have no idea how many hours it took, but I suspect it took at least three to four hours to generate this one video. So it is quite a long time. But anyway, finally, I got the result. Now, before I show you what the final video looked like, let me show you the original clip from this video. So this is the original video. This is Sparta! Okay, and this is the one that has been modified by AI. Just take a look. This is Sparta! Okay, I think it looks decent. It is able to maintain the same character consistency and the movement and also the audio. But I noticed at least three problems in this video. So first of all, there is this white artifacts on the suit for some reason, but this is seemingly a common problem. I saw some people using this AI model and experienced this issue in some areas in the video, but hopefully in the future they can improve the model so stuff like this will not appear on the video anymore. So that was the first problem. But the second problem is Notice that th this is still the same character, but now it is, uh, st it is still wearing the original outfit, even though on this scene, the character is wearing something that looks more formal. So yeah, it is not able, the air model is not smart enough to actually uh, know that this is still the same character. So I think it is still acceptable. I think there is almost no AI model out there, at least right now, that is able to uh, 
just know that it is still the same person so i think it is still okay but the third problem is also quite obvious notice here that in the background in the uh, version where it has been modified the background is not the same as in the original video so the original video shows you a background that look like this but in the ai version the background is actually from the background of this photo so yeah i should be i should have been removing the background first before putting this image into the air model so yeah if you want to make sure that it is not you know infusing any other background in the video then make sure that the photo is clean it is only showing the subject and nothing else but Overall, I would say the result is still acceptable, it looks great, and maybe in the future it's going to get better. And by the way, if you want to download this video, you can click the, the download button, and then of course it's going to be with a watermark. But if you want to get a video with a watermark, then you can subscribe to the paid version, and it is also quite affordable compared to other AI models. So that's essentially how you can use the one animate model to replace the character from a video with somebody else or somebody else character so thank you so much for watching and i'll see you on my next video have a great day